Fired fire. Hey folks, Wish SE. I've been asked to do a demonstration by a couple of my subscribers uh, about shooting from the pocket and pros and cons to revolvers versus uh, semi-automatic pistols. So at the very beginning of this, I have to say, this is not for you to go and do and try. There's uh, some danger associated with this. And if you want to do it, go to a, tra a class, learn the process, and work with someone who's qualified to teach this type of thing. So what I think you're going to see here is that a revolver, from the standpoint of having to shoot through a pocket or a jacket, has an advantage to a semi-auto because the semi-auto, in most cases, is going to lock up. So we're going to demonstrate that right now. Again, do not try this at home. So the first gun that we're going to use is the air weight. I'm going to be shooting through this uh, through one pocket over here. So we've got uh, five shots, 38 special. We're going to shoot them through the pocket. And again, you don't want to do this if you don't have training. This is uh, purely something uh, that uh, we're going to demonstrate for you just to show you the advantage. And then we're going to do the same thing with the Ruger LCP. So went right through, tore up the bottom of the jacket. Fired five shots. Gun is still functioning. Able to dump all five rounds in our uh, target here, in the center mass of our target. Pretty well destroyed the end of this. But again, from a combat shooting uh, standpoint of self-defense, if you had to, you could shoot through uh, the pocket so the next gun we're going to shoot is the Ruger 380. It's the exact same thing. Index on my target, right? Fire. Interestingly, because I pressed through, what was actually I expected to happen that didn't happen was we were actually able to shoot and the gun did not lock up due to the slide hanging up in our clothing, which is surprising. So we're going to try it with another jacket, a heavier jacket, and see if the same thing holds true there. Index on my target, right? Fire. And here we go. And that's what I was afraid would happen. And what's happening is we're getting this malfunction here where as the gun cycles in recoil it's getting wrapped around the material that has been blown apart so this is where a revolver really makes a big difference again I'm not saying that this is practical I'm just saying that this might happen so with this type of jacket versus the lighter weight jacket, this gun has got, had that type 1 malfunction now twice, both times, even though it's pretty torn up, even though the jacket itself is, is pretty, pretty well ripped up. So I've indexed on the target down there, and here we go. Okay, so again, we've got this very heavy jacket. We've got our air weight shooting 158 grain plated bullets. I'm going to shoot through the jacket and I think with again what we're going to see is whether or not the jacket prevents the revolver from working. So here we go. And right away simply by firing what, what, what happened was it ripped the jacket right out and we have no problem firing now. And of course because it's a revolver we're not getting caught up on anything. So I think what that shows you is that with a coat, with this type of coat or this type of jacket, um, you will be able to shoot through it versus um, a lighter uh, jacket with a semi-automatic, which is more than likely going to get tied up as that side slide cycles.
Well, folks, that is a demonstration that was asked for by a couple of subscribers who wanted to know what happens if and when you shoot through the pocket using either a revolver like this one, the airway, or a semi-automatic pistol, in this case the Ruger LCP. What we saw didn't really surprise me, and that was when shooting the semi-automatic during recoil, as the slide was cycling back and forth, it was getting caught up on the material and inducing malfunctions. The revolver, on the other hand, due to its design, its revolving cylinder, didn't have those same problems. Is shooting through the pocket the ideal way to, to go? Absolutely not. My only point is we don't know if we're going to have the time to present. Many people carry in a pocket holster. Uh, and might be able to get the gun out of the holster and uh, might have to shoot through their pocket. Not recommended. There are safety issues associated with this. Don't go out and try this. But it is important to note that if you had to do that, the revolver would no doubt be the better choice for that type of situation. And in fact, that's one of the reasons many people still prefer revolvers to semi-automatics. There's a lot to be said for a revolver due to its ease of use and simplicity in handling. I want to thank you all for watching. If you like this video or any of the videos that we produce, click the thumbs up icon. If you didn't like it, instead of just clicking the thumbs down, let me know what you didn't like about it so I can hopefully make a better video for you. I really do appreciate the fact that uh, we've had great growth over the last year, tremendous support from your subscribers, and that really means a lot. Have a wonderful holiday season, and as always, stay safe.